Last Friday's jobs report we think deserves a closer look as it shows how quickly the U.S. economy can rebound with vaccination rates higher and the reopening of some states. In that report, leisure and hospitality jobs increased by 355,000, and of that, 268,000 came from food services. That would include bars, restaurants, 36,000 from hotels and amusements. We look for uh, even bigger numbers coming in March with eight states pulling back restrictions the first week of this month. You know, it seems to me that people are taking a closer look at the things they buy and the labels on those things to make sure they're made in the USA. Well, if you look at any livestock ID tag from Witex, you'll see it's made in Cody, Wyoming. That's just one more reason livestock producers like doing business with USA-made Witex. This is the Bottom Line Report. We see a lot of pent-up consumer demand as spring and summer approach, more states lifting restrictions. Crude oil is back near $70 a barrel to start the week, the highest since July of 2018. U.S. refineries are operating at only 56% capacity. That's the lowest ever recorded. Gasoline inventory is currently about 8.5 million barrels below a year ago. So, again, we encourage producers to watch pricing of gasoline and diesel fuel for their spring needs. I'm Mark Oppold, wishing you a profitable week ahead.